Here we have Max, and we are going to be pricing the passage of these bottom two lines. He's playing triple dip. He's the middle player. And the game we're going to play to practice this passage is called the Towers of Mozart. Now to play this, you need a deck of cards. Here we are using Skippo cards. You can use normal face cards, though, um, with values 1 through 10. A jack is 11, queen is 12, king is... 13 and ace is 14. Here, come down here, Max. Okay, now the goal of this game is to have the first pile equal the second pile. Here, you want to hold the camera? All right. So, if you'll take a look, you want to draw four cards for the for the second pile. They are two, nine. Three and one. What does that add up, add up to, Max? Can you do that? Uh, 15. Fifteen. Fifteen. Wow, you're fast. Okay, so within this practice section, we want to create another pile that adds up to 15. So first, we're going to draw a card. Max, you got a two. And so if you play that passage up there correctly, you can add that two to your first pile. If not, the two is going to go in this pile. So this pile just gets higher and higher that you have to match. Let's see if you can earn that too. Forgot to add the fourth uh, yes. set of eighth notes, and then got a little bit jumbled up on yeah. this second measure. Mm -hmm. So, but good thing it's only a two. So what is this now? Seventeen. 17. Okay. Uh, do you want to draw another card? It's an eight. Ooh, you got an eight. That's like half of that value. Okay, let's try it again. Oh, that was music to my ears. Are you happy about that? Yes. Okay, so now you got the eight in your pile. Let's draw another card. Four. Four. So that would put you at 12. That's pretty good. Let's see if you can earn that to put in your pile. Um, let's try this line over here since you've already mastered that one. Perfect. So 12 and the second pile is 17. Now it's 16. Ooh, so almost. Let's pick. Ooh, this next page. It looks like there's a time signature. It goes from a 3 4 to a 4 4. Let's try it. Seventeen. All you needed was a one, and you got a six. So let's hope we don't mess up because, I mean, it's perfectly fine if you get it right, but if you mess up, that adds to the second pile. Okay, so, so let's try one. that line. Oh, whoops. <laughs> whoops. Okay, so second pile has six. Uh, so what is that? Twenty-three, 23 verse sixteen. Oh, good. I got a seven. <laughs> But he oh, got it. Well, if I get this, I get the 23. Yep, if he gets that, it equals that second pile. Okay. This kid's fast at math. Okay, well, think about it carefully before you begin. Okay, I definitely messed up. <laughs> Do you want to finish practicing it? And then... Looks like we had that seven, and so what is that? 30 verse 16. It looks like he needs 14 more points. Oh, and he got a one. Okay, hopefully you can get this. Good.
Oh, how good does that feel? At least you got Nothing. one point. But you got it right. All right. Oh. So that goes to yours. So another one. seventeen verse thirty. Oh. Okay, I like this next part. Do you want to just play the top line? Let's just play the top line. Perfect. So eighteen verse thirty. Draw another. Eight. Eight. Ooh. Then you'd be twenty-six verse thirty. Let's try that line right under. Good job. Let's draw another. Let's see, so I'm 20. Oh, why am I getting all these ones? So that put you 27, right? Mm -hmm. Let's try If he gets this, he wins. If not, more to practice. Okay, let's do this last line right okay. here. <laughs> Got it right. Finally, you beat that second pile. And that, my friends, is how you play Tower of Mozart.